my role on Transparent is very much about managing and monitoring the politics of trans representation, taking on initiatives with the trans community. The show is really created on a feminist structure, so there's primarily women, queer folks, LGBT folks. We've had, I think, 41 trans people as speaking cast and as production crew. So we've kind of integrated the community into the very structure, which I think creates like a really authentic rendering. If you actually can walk in the shoes of transness, it is, I think, a gift. Early on, Jeffrey Tambor didn't have a fluency or an understanding of the trans experience, and I helped him understand it from a lot of different angles and got him dressed up for the first time. Like, it was kind of his guide. I didn't have an easy time in high school because I was really coming into myself as a genderqueer, as a gender non-conforming person, and was really kind of looking for a community and a place to land. Well, the thing that really got me through was photography. So I developed like a really strong portfolio. I got a scholarship to go to SBA and I was off. <laughs> I think so often about my studies at the School of Visual Arts and, you know, lessons that I learned from my professors. Many of them are people that I'm still really close with. You're learning from people who are able to keep their heads above water in like the most competitive city in America. All of the training, all of the kind of knowledge that you've gained along the way informs what you're doing. Knowledge is the only thing that no one will ever take away from you.